Over the next week, more than 100,000 people will be braving the heat and packing into the fairgrounds to enjoy the Ozark Empire Fair. It is a long-standing tradition in Springfield involving livestock shows, carnival rides, and some great fair food. Color 10 Sydney Moran is live outside of the Empire Fairgrounds sharing how crews have kept this fair going for decades. Well, it's all about the preparation. That's testing out rides, updating security, and even getting cattle show ready. It started back, I mean, the old pictures, they were in tents and they hauled Carnival in on railroad and stuff like that. It's a celebration that happens every year around the end of July. 87 years later, the fair is filled with rides, concession stands, and animals. It's just a good way to like market your cattle or meet new people. Rebecca and Hannah Evans have traveled from Squires for the past three years to participate in cattle shows. There was a lot more competition and a lot more people to meet. So it was kind of a, a big change to see what everyone else was doing. The two spent their summer rinsing off their cows and taking them to other events before the fair opens Thursday. Yesterday we came up and we like set up our stall dividers and the fans and stuff. So all we had to do today, all we had to do today was bring up the cattle. The effort starts even earlier for those behind the scenes. We have planning meetings throughout the year. We're way better prepared than they were 87 years ago. Fair CEO Aaron Owen says efforts ramp up the week before the fair opens. Rides have been here for over a week and getting set up and getting in place. And the work requires many hands. We end up with about 160 on the payroll throughout the fair. And then the carnival, they'll be they'll be packing another 80, 90 people with them. Well, about three-fourths of us stay on site most every night. Um, I do as well. The gates open at 4 tomorrow, and for those worried about the heat, there is some good news. Owen says there are air-conditioned areas on the premises. Reporting in Springfield, City Moran, Color 10 News.